Hello everybody, it's Quan and I'm back with another video. Now, time for a little fun thing I like to call speculation rotation. We've seen this spin back and forth where people make uh, some kind of a statement, you know, an assumption about some future feature in the console, some future direction a console is going to take and see where it's going to go. And I'm starting to see something here, though, in the case of Nintendo. And paying very careful attention to certain things. Now, as many of you know, Nintendo has, one, beefed up the iOS slash, you know, uh, Android cross-compatibility -compa as far as videos are concerned, you know, that, you know, originate from them and that are published as far as being compatible with the YouTube app within the Wii U. Okay. But another thing that's interesting is they recently released the app on 3DS. Okay, no big deal. All this coinciding right prior to Miiverse being put in full swing on the 3DS as well as the Nintendo Network ID. Quad, where are you going with this? You might be wondering. Okay. If anybody's familiar with Google Hangouts at all, and I brought this up in times past, okay, it's the same company that makes Google Hangouts for Google slash YouTube, because, you know, when you have a Hangout, it publishes to YouTube. Anyway, for those, you know, for that company and its subsidiary, the same company responsible for that is responsible for WeChat. Now, I have a feeling they were intending on perhaps bringing the Google Hangout-like infrastructure to the Wii U. But what threw a curveball with this whole issue that they had in Japan, that little disgusting thing that happened on Swap Note. Something tells me they were going to come up with a hybrid system at one point. But that put a little snafu in the works because, of course, nobody wants to get sued over what some random perv does online. You know what I'm saying? If you're a big company like Nintendo, Microsoft, or Sony. As a matter of fact, uh, Microsoft's been banning people for cussing on uh, Xbox Live, if I'm not mistaken, in vid form. Not sure. Don't quote me on it since I don't own an Xbox. I've heard stories about people saying that there was lewd behavior going on on the PlayStation Network side of things as far as the PS4. Since I don't know PS4, I can't say for sure that I know that's happened or not. But it seems like these companies are now starting to be on edge as far as just how much freedom they can give people to sit up here and chit-chat. But I digress. Getting back to the subject at hand. Is Nintendo intending on bringing out a Hangout structure on the Wii U along with the 3DS? And if so, if that's their intention, as well as you know, finding some way to like publish vids or something of the like, some kind of vid capture function, who knows? Because you could already do audio files, okay? That's pretty much what's in Deus Ex. I mean, I don't know what would stop them from doing vids. You know, there there is a DVR, sla you know, functionality that's encoded within the, um, the, you know, the remote app that they have for the Wii U, which makes me wonder, is it a universal control for DVR or an actual DVR function that's already embedded in Wii U? After all, there's 40% of the CPU unaccounted for by a lot of people. There's no telling what functions are lying under there, but still. Do you guys think perhaps Nintendo is trying to really push a social network infrastructure, you know, with full chat functionality on the Wii U or not? 
you know? I would like to hear your, your thoughts below. I, I seem to think that if it wasn't for that whole entire disgusting ordeal that happened over there in Japan and quite possibly could have happened here in the States, that Nintendo could have sat up there and put a decent, you know, chat system into place. Right in time for the 3DS's launch of, you know, their version of Miiverse. But unfortunately, idiots being what they are, decided to spoil the pooch for the rest of us. They sat up there and spoiled the punch. They spit in the punch bowl, everybody. Decided to be jackasses. They had their cup and decided to take a big loogie. Yep, that's right. I'm being gross about it because that's what it was. It was disgusting what they did. You know? But what do you guys think? Okay? Looking at all these things going on and the companies involved, is Nintendo trying to bring some type of bigger social networking strategy that's YouTube slash Google specific using Vidyo, the same company responsible for Hangouts? Okay? That's, that's a th theory I'm spitballing here. Okay? Now, I'm not saying I'm absolutely right. I won't claim to be a genius if somehow I am right. You know what I'm saying? It was just an educated guess. It could be wrong. For all I know, you know, Nintendo's not going to do jack with any of this. But it's nice to, you know, come up with something and whatever and think about what the future may hold for, you know, your favorite companies and whatever, you know? And who knows? Maybe there's something along the lines. Maybe this is not Nintendo. Maybe I'm missing the mark altogether. And this could be a goal that's in mind by Microsoft or Sony, which they're already showing that they already are, you know, going for the social networks, but instead of touting their own social network as strongly, they're touting already made social networks. But Nintendo seems to try to seems to be trying to come up with some type of integration to fold Miiverse as a way of trying to either either regulate or steer the conversation to keep it gaming. So Sound off below. Let me know what you think about this whole entire issue. Do you think Nintendo's going somewhere with these little slow, slow baby steps they're taking? Or are they just going to end up falling flat on your face? Sound off below. Like, dislike. Subscribe or not. Do what you will. Okay? And uh, just keep it decent. And we'll get along fine, as I always say. Whatever's clever.